Well, it was a heartwarming welcome for some of Huntsville's own World War II veterans who landed today, receiving a very warm welcome after a special trip abroad. Our Sydney Stallworth was at the airport when they arrived and has more on the surprise waiting for them at the gate. A well-deserved welcome home. Six of Huntsville's local World War II veterans made their way off the plane and into the embrace of family, friends, and those in the community who'd like to say thank you. We want them to feel loved. We want them to know that we appreciate them. They don't have to know or recognize our faces, but we are American. They have fought for us. So we just want to let them know we love them and we appreciate what they've done for us. Returning home from a trip to Belgium, Luxembourg, and Germany, honoring the 75th anniversary of the Battle of the Bulge, and in many cases, visiting the very places in which they served during the war. A trip that brought memories, grief, honor, and closure and a crowd beaming with excitement as they wait to welcome home their heroes. He said, hey, let's come out and support one of our own and bring him home and welcome him home. So it felt good to us to see him, and we knew he was going to be surprised to see us. They're talking about Mr. Charles Henry, who volunteered to serve in World War II at a time when he was denied placement and fair treatment because of the color of his skin. He went on to become one of the U.S. Army's first black paratroopers, and he says despite the prejudice, he turned his adversities into triumph, and he's not done fighting just yet. We just can't accept what they give us. We can't accept us. This isn't it. The new day, the new day coming in, and this is a start for me. A start for me. Putting the Valley first, Cindy Stallworth, WZDX News. A big thank you to all of those veterans for serving. And the veterans also visited sites in Belgium and Luxembourg. They even met up with eight other American World War II veterans while they were there to share the experience.